Okay, week four video update. Uh, this is the second take. I put one up uh, earlier that I think I'm going to pull down because it's not exciting. But uh, I did a lot of work today, so we'll make this the week four update. And you can see I've taken these boards off of the old fence, which was that one right there along there. And I just kept them, and then I put them around here to shade the tanks from the sun. So hopefully it'll keep a lot of the heat out of the tanks. And uh, so my filter is running strong, still doing perfect. Today I got some, some starter plants from the nursery so that I could expedite things a little bit. So I've got a couple tomatoes in here. My beans are still doing good on the back. I've got some little broccolis coming up. Um, these are a couple melons. That's, uh, these are all peppers, a couple bell peppers and a bunch of like Italian peppers or something of that nature. And then there's another tomato in the back. I'm hoping to take this tomato here and grow it up like a trellis up onto the fence because it's a cherry tomato so hopefully it'll bind out. Um, these are the these are the cantaloupes from uh, before and they're doing good. These beets are coming up nice although I think it's gonna get too hot for them here in a hurry um, and I'm not sure how well they'll do in the rocks anyways but we'll see. The beans in the back are doing really well. Um, the exciting part here though is that I stopped and got some fish yesterday. If you look in there hopefully you can see the catfish in the back. There's 20 Oh, no, 10 catfish in here. Um, this, this other tank, this tank here, has 20 hybrid carp. You can see them darting around there on the bottom. They're really, really quick. And then uh, this other tank here has 10 more catfish, the smaller ones. So down here on this part, I've got my strawberry towers are going strong still. Um, some of these plants in here are starting to come out you can see but I've installed my backup pump and that's this is the, the switch for it and I've got a, the pump plugged into the switch here and then the, the pump this is the where the pump plugs in this is where the switch plugs in the switch runs down to the extension cord and then there's another water line you can see right here coming out of the bar it goes down and it keeps this full of water and if this runs out of water then the pump jumps up and turns on the backup or the uh, the bottle will jump up pulled by a spring and hit, turn the backup pump on and the back backup pump is right down there i don't know if you can see it but it's the white thing down there in the bottom so pretty exciting i've got a lot going on most of my system's done backups done plants are in fish are in now let's uh, see how she goes thanks for watching